Hello and welcome to this week's edition of the Engineering News and Mining Weekly magazine, published on Friday, 19 May 2023. In this week's cover article, Engineering News and Mining Weekly senior deputy editor Irma Fenter writes that electric trucks can work in South Africa. Swedish truck maker Volvo Trucks believes it's possible to successfully operate electric trucks locally, given the right operational parameters. So much so that the group is rolling out an entire range of heavy-duty trucks. The engineering news features focus on valves, where bigger and more efficient valves are needed in mining. Heavy lifting and abnormal loads, where automated cranes gain traction despite concerns and heating, ventilation, air conditioning and refrigeration, where outsourced cooling can help the market navigate challenges. The Mining Weekly features focus on junior mining, where a copper prospecting project uses a dual growth strategy. And Zambian Mining and Industry, where a drive technology company is driven to help meet Zambia's energy efficiency goals. This week's business leader is Michael Dawn, founder and CEO of global business restructuring firm RT Group. And in this week's cartoon, if South Africa hopes to sustain its non-aligned foreign policy stance, it will need to become far more proactive in defining what that means. Otherwise, it risks becoming entirely irrelevant on the international stage. We hope you enjoy this week's edition of Crema Media's Engineering News and Mining Weekly. Be sure to subscribe to the magazine that offers you in-depth news about developments in the real economy by emailing subscriptions at engineeringnews.co.za. Enjoy the read and see you next time.